Hello everybody, this is T with Kate's Crafty Closets. Today I'm going to show you what new products that we have in the store this week. There's actually quite a few, so this will be a little longer video than normal. So let's go ahead and get ourselves started. So the first thing we have is these framelits from Sizzix. These are called square frames. So you get eight of them in here in different sizes. I think it tells you on the back the sizes, like one and a quarter inch by one and a quarter inch to four and a quarter inch by four and a quarter inch. So I got that. Next up we have these dies from Sizzix. This one is called floral frames we have that then we have this paper pad from kaiser craft called enchanted garden you get, these are six and a half inch papers so these are the different um papers you get inside of it 12 two by tw two by 12 sheets so you get 12 of each um paper okay then we have this hero arts set this is happy birthday i'm sorry like all kinds of different sentiments all in one very versatile next up we have from sizzix and lisa jones this one is called wild blossom corners it's really kind of cool that you get those in one die you can color or you can cut again and put it on top of it then next up we have from Melissa Jones and Sizzix this one is called wild blossom borders so these are more of a borders those were the corners and you get 12 dies in this one you get the individual flowers that you can place on top of the larger one next up we have from Tim Holtz and Sizzix um, this one is called um, Butterfly Duo. So you get the Biggs die, which cuts heavier materials, and you get the embossing folder, or as they call them, texture fades, that will emboss that cutout die. Too cool, right? Then we have this paper pad from um, Crate Paper. So you get 36 sheets. And these are the different designs that you get in there. Some wood grain. Can't go wrong with that. Then we have some memento dewdrops. These are like the greens. You get four different greens in that package. Okay. Then we have some TCW mixed media slimline boards. So these are thick, like matte boards and stuff that are for the slimline craze that's going on right now so you have these for mixed media to display and next up is kind of excited about this product it's stone paper which is actually washable paper from stamperia really kind of cool um and you can do like it's great for like putting these as on your covers of your uh, albums and stuff like that because it's you know it's washable it's not gonna you know, go crazy ripping and soaking up and breaking breaking down. So washable stone paper from Stamperia. Check that out. Um, you get one sheet in the package. Okay. Next up, we have some framelit dies from Sizzix. Um, the first one we have is squares. Okay. Then we have scallop squares I think that's what it's called scallop squares yeah scallop squares and then finally we have some scallop ovals from Sizzix uh, each one of those are probably between four and six dies so we have those then we have trying to keep things neat and straight here so I don't go missing them next up we have this Paper pad from Jen Hadfield, Simple Life. So these are the different, um, so you got some plaid going on in there, some florals, really cool, nice paper pad. Then we have from Sizzix, this one is called Script Sentiment. So you get happy birthday with love, happy anniversary, congratulations. 
that cuts the words for you. Then we have from Avery L. This one is called Reversed reverse Pinked Dye. So you get three different frames, and it's stitched, and it's pinked. Well, not stitched. That's more like the pink dots. Okay. Then we have some sequins. These are called Rouge. You get uh, eight different colors in the red family. Really cool if you like shaker cards, too. Next up, we have from Sizzix. This die is called Labels Elegant Number no. 2. Okay. Then we have from My Favorite Things. This is a Merry die. Stacked Merry from Merry Christmas or... You can use it for Mary, whatever, like, okay. Then we have from Spellbinders. This one's called Candlewick Oval. So you get seven different dyes in here. Some are just plain, and then you have the Candlewick looking ones in there. So you get three of those, and it looks like you get four of the regular ovals, which are good to stack that on top of the oval behind it. That's kind of what it's meant for, so you can see through. Then we have some, um, this is some Tombow Mono Liquid Glue. This one's Aqua. It's like clear. So I get two, you get dual applicators on, on, on those and the brush and a, a larger nib. Then we have from Hero Arts, this My Little Hoot stamp set. So you get the owls, the bears, and the elephant, and some sentiments to go along with it. Then we have this stamp set from Bow Bunny. This one is called Rough It Up Stamp. So you get some great textured backgrounds, these cobblestones, like some wood grain, and some cross hatches. Really, that's a cool set. I like that. Next up is from Stamp Pendus. We have these clear stamps. These are, I believe, called Big Words. Happy. You get the happy love, congrats, and you get the smaller sentiments that go along with those larger ones. And then from Art Impressions, we have this unmounted cling rubber stamp right here. Okay. Then we have from Tim Holtz and Ranger, alcohol ink hardcore art panels. You get three different sizes, an 8x8, a 6x6, and a 4x4. So this is the use your alcohol inks on. And they'll create some cool little hanging wall art and stuff. Next up, we have this Sizzix 3D embossing folder. And this one is called Mosaic Gems. I love these 3D embossing folders. They're really cool once you run them through. Next up, we have from Sizzix. This one is called Songbird. So you get, how many dies you get in here? I think just the one. Yeah, just a one die. It's kind of cool that it cuts it all out. I like that. Cuts it all out. You don't have to piece together. Yay. Then we have a Glimmer Foil die from Spellbinders. This one, I believe, says um, Faux Script Thinking of You. Faux Script Thinking of You. Okay. And that's for your foil. It's a Glimmer Foil machine. Next up from Alta New. We have this stamp set called Wispy Begonia. Really pretty. I love the fonts in there. Then we have some slimline envelopes in the craft. So these are, I think you get 25 of them in there. For your slimline cards. Um, next up we have from Sizzix. This one is called Butterfly Set Number 2. These work in any of the machines. These are kind of the older versions, but those will work. Then we have from Bow Bunny, we have this Cup of Joe stamp set. The coffee mugs and little coffee sentiments. Really cool. If you're a coffee lover, I know somebody who is. Next up is we have some enamel dots. These are from Echo Park. I don't know if these have a name to them. They may. Or they may not, yes. It's called Pirate Tales. So it gets some blues and reds and some white. Okay. Next up, we have a Sizzix 3D embossing folder. This one is called Bohemian Botanicals. I like this one. Kind of want to keep it for myself, but I'm not. Next up, we have a 
Julie Nutting Prima stamp set. This one is called, um, I don't know what his name is, Aiden. There it is. Clean rubber from Prima and Julie Nutting. Elizabeth Crafts, we have this Dancing Butterflies. And then from Spellbinders and Seth After, we have this ring around a mixed media die, or you can use this for card making as well. Then we have from Elizabeth Crafts, this one I believe is a triangle box. So it makes that little box great for little gifts and stuff like that, even great to make ornaments for a Christmas tree. Next up we have from Hero Arts is this sentiment set for Christmas really big I like those kind of goes across a whole core a cord a card not a cord um, this one just is called jolly tonight that's cool next up from Sizzix and Linda Kanasi um, this one is a mini envelope so you get the little mini envelope and you get the little label and you get the stamp as well and they're kind of cool if you, if you do mini envelopes you can put those on top of cards inside mini albums and stuff Next up, we have, I'm sorry, we have a Craft of Lanch. And um, we have this Prima Mixed Media book right here. So it's a hard cover. You can decorate that. And you have all your pages on the inside of that. This is A5, and which is um, 5.9 five inches by 8.3 inches to give you an idea. Then we have this Bow Bunny. This is an oval ornate chipboard frame. So you only get one frame in there. Kind of cool to decorate, mix media it up. And then finally, we have this nesting Starburst dies from We Are Memory Keepers. Like I said, this is great for card making as well, scrapbooking, albums, and all of that fun stuff. So that is all the new products that we have in the store this week. So I want to thank you all for your support. It's greatly appreciated. Make sure you check out the website at casecraftycloset.com and make sure you use coupon code SAVE5, the number five, and save $5 off of your order of $25 or more. And thank y'all so much, and y'all have a crafty day, y'all.